With the aim to provide a successful platform for the exchange of ideas, Thomas Cook India Group hosted the second edition of the India Travel Summit in New Delhi. We wanted to build a platform where uh, stakeholders in the travel industry could come and use it to discuss various issues. The idea is to get the perspectives and see how we can define the future of this industry. The theme, the new age of travel this year, was more relevant because we wanted all these partners to come together and talk about how the disruptions are creating both opportunities and challenges. The objective of the summit is basically to have a dialogue and a conversation amongst different stakeholders from the industry to look at where the business is today and more importantly, where are we heading to in the next five to ten years. Gentlemen, if you want to beat the Indians, you have to think like Indians. Eat like Indians. And if it has to be, dance like Indians. Coach, shouldn't we also fly like Indians? Absolutely. Namaste. Non-stop you. Lufthansa. Aqua Sun shares expansion plans. Starting with DMC platform, now we are going totally online. Uh, already Mauritius, Maldives, Seychelles, all the islands are online. Probably in the next three months, you will see all the Far East destinations online. They are going to start Europe in a very big way from next year. We are starting Bali from next month. Andhra Pradesh was declared the best state for comprehensive development of tourism at the National Tourism Awards for 2015 to 16. Rajasthan stole second, while Kerala and Goa received the third prize. It's very important to recognize the stalwarts, those who have pushed the envelope and made things happen. I think the departure this year is that we have now fixed upon the World Tourism Day as the date for the National Tourism Awards.